In this video, we'll be downloading and installing the online version of the Trimble Installation Manager software to a Windows 10 laptop PC. If you're not familiar with Trimble Installation Manager, um, for many Trimble instruments, this can be a super useful utility for updating instrument firmware, uh, checking for latest firmware versions, downloading release notes, installing license options, and a whole host of uh, other uses. And uh, it's a free utility and it's easy to use, so let's uh, just do it. So to begin with, I'll go ahead and I'll go online. I happen to be using Google Chrome as my browser of choice. And we'll start by going to Trimble.com. And once there, what we'll do is we're going to go ahead and click the Support drop-down tab. And we'll go to Product Support and Support A to Z. There in the Support A to Z list, I'm going to go ahead and scroll down to Installation Manager. And we'll just go ahead and click on that. And there's several different choices of versions to download here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to select the online version. In my Google Chrome browser, I need to right click on this and go ahead and hit Save Link As. And I'm just going to go ahead and down, save that to my download directory. So I'll go ahead and hit Save. I'll give that just a second while that's doing its thing. I'm going to go ahead and close out of uh, this page. And uh, it's a small utility, it only takes a moment, so I'm going to go ahead now and go to my Downloads folder. And I'm just going to go ahead and select the program we just downloaded. So it's an MSI file. Um, like, most, uh, my, like most application programs, of course, you will need uh, administrative rights to install software on, on uh, most computers. So if that's an issue for you, make sure you check with your IT professional. But I'm just going to go ahead and click on this and follow the on-screen prompts things up. Let me just close that out in the background. And we'll go ahead and hit next. I'll agree to the license agreement. I'll hit next. I'll accept all the default directories. And we'll hit next. And we'll answer yes to the user account control. And I'll just go ahead and launch that utility. So I can just go ahead and hit close. And Trimble Installation Manager is opening up and launching now. So we don't have a connected device at this stage of the game, but if we did, what we could do is we could connect up that device and select the appropriate device or the appropriate category from the left-hand side. If you're looking for more specific information on a specific device, you could click the Help option and that'll let you know information about specific software or receivers and so on and so forth. But once things are connected together, what you would do is grab the appropriate category, ensure that it's connected. In the upper right, select the appropriate release version. You'll want to make sure that your software maintenance warranty is up to date if necessary and then simply go ahead and install. So in a separate video, we'll actually show that process, but for now, hopefully that helps, and we'll see you next time.